Hey there, Chef Jeff here at White Apron Catering in Lake Worth. Today we're going to do a corn and edamame succotash salad. Nice little succotash, little take on that, make it a little fresh and clean and light. So we're going to do that. We've got some, uh, some nice fresh corn that we've got here. And instead of the typical lima beans, we're going to do some edamame. So I've got some that are already shelled here. Sometimes you're going to just going to find them and they're not going to be shelled, but they're easy enough to shell. You just pop them out. And shell them just like the old, the old beans. But these are already shucked, so we're going to do that. So we've got those. I've got a little uh, red pepper and some poblano pepper. The poblanos will give it a nice little bite to that. A um, little red onion and some uh, some uh, parsley. The other seasonings. We got a little extra virgin olive oil and some rice wine vinegar. Let's get started. Now, first thing with the corn. The big thing with the corn is like if you're going to get nice fresh corn and it's nice and young and it's going to be sweet. Sometimes it's a little older, if it's a little bigger, it's going to be a little starchy. If it's a little starchy, you're going to need to blanch it off. So how do you tell? Really, the only way to tell is to try a little bit. So we're going to take some of that and we're just going to try a little bite. And if it's nice and sweet like that, we don't need to blanch it off. So we're not going to. If you do blanch it off, just lightly salted water. Pop it in there for about a minute, minute and a half. Bring it out, cold ice water. Shock it down there for another couple minutes. Let it cool. And then we're just going to shuck it through. One of the easiest ways to do it, shuck it off the cob, is use your mandolin. And just set it at a pretty wide setting and just run it around. It takes it right off the cob. There you go. Just like that. Now I've got some already shucked, so we're just going to get it started. So we've got our corn. And then we're going to take our edamame. And the edamame you might want to blanch as well. So we're going to take this over and we're going to blanch this and be right back. And this is just going to need to go in for about a minute. Pop it down in the boiling water back into some ice water and drain it out. So be right back. Now we're back. We've got that all blanched and drained and we're ready to go. So let's start mixing it up. All right. So we've got our corn. We're going to add that in. And our edamame. And then like I said, we've got some, uh, some red onion and we'll dice up just a little bit more. But remember, we're going to do these and we're just going to Follow the radial of the onion. And that's going to get you a nice even dice on that. And then just. So we do a little onion. And then we've got some of our peppers. We've got some of those already diced up. And again, you're just going to. Cut them into little juliennes here. And then just chop them straight across. And you get a nice even square cut. Just make sure you keep your fingers out of the way and you're good to go. And the rest of those. And then we're going to take a little parsley. And we're just going to chop a little of that fresh Italian parsley in there. And other than that, we're just going to do a little salt and pepper. And like I said, a little rice wine vinegar, some olive oil. And you are good to go for a perfect summer corn succotash salad. pepper and a little salt and then we'll season this up with a little olive oil and then the rice wine vinegar and the, and the vinegar will set in with the with the corn and the edamame and make that just beautiful give that a little light toss and a little of the rice wine vinegar 
and voila. And here you have it. Look at the colors. Look at the way that pops. Just gorgeous. All right. So here's our edamame and corn succotash salad. Chef Jeff here at White Apron Catering. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy it. Let me know.